just finished racing the Rev3 Barrelman Triathlon put on by Multisport Canada. It was a really solid race for me. I finished second in, I think I was about 4.02. Um, the race started out in the Welland Flatwater Center and um, I didn't feel like I had the, uh, the greatest swim there, but uh, I ended up swimming a lot of it solo. Um, out onto the bike in the early stages, I felt um, I felt pretty strong, and then went through a bit of a lull from about 30 to 50k until kind of my legs came around and I was able to pick it up again. And at uh, about 70k, I could see the leaders uh, Jordan and Alex in front of me, so I pushed harder than I planned on pushing in the final 15k in order to uh, to catch them and try and get into transition before them. Out onto the run, my goal is to just try and run really steady. And um, so I left, uh, I left transition with the idea of running about a uh, about four minute kilometers. And uh, it's really hot here today. So on the first loop, I was able to hold pretty close to that. But then on the second loop, my, uh, my pace waned a little bit. So um, right away, Alex and, uh, and Jordan overtook me pretty quickly coming out of, uh, coming out of transition. Uh, but I just kind of stuck with it. And I ended up catching Alex at about 13 kilometers and was able to hold on um, to finish in second place. So really happy with, uh, with the result and uh, with the splits that I put together. My run was a little bit slower than, um, than I expected, but I think a lot of that has to do with the conditions and pushing a little bit harder on the bike. So overall, um, really happy um, with my splits, really happy with how my legs have responded to uh, just a little bit of rest after uh, putting in another big week of recovery. I have four weeks until Louisville. Uh, so Louisville is looking at uh, being my last race of the season. So I'm really hoping to have a, uh, a big race there. The uh, race here, the uh, Barrel Mountain Triathlon, really was a really great race. It's really cool that on the run, you get to run by Niagara Falls uh, twice. So you see both the American and the Canadian Falls. The, uh, the bike course is pretty flat and fast course. Uh, the conditions were good for a uh, for fast times today, and uh, in the race that the um, multi sport team puts on, they uh, they do a really good job to create a really interesting, uh, really fun course. So, would certainly recommend that uh, others check this out. I think they said it's the biggest non Ironman uh, half distance triathlon in North America now. They had over a thousand people uh, racing today so uh, it's definitely a really great race and one that you should check out. Thanks a lot for watching this week's video. If you like what you see please click the subscribe button down below and until next time happy training. Oh this new crazy mother